Trout Life recently announced changes to fishing rules. Our Ryan Spenson shares the rules ease weight and length restrictions imposed a couple years ago. Meet the new rules, same as the old rules. After the freeze of 2021, the Texas Department of Parks and Wildlife studied the effect weather had on the local fish population. What experts found was a reduction in numbers, especially for the spotted sea trout. The Texas Parks and Wildlife Department decided it needed to take action. They uh, thought it best to change the regulation, which was originally 15 inches to 25 inches and five fish total per angler. They switched it to 17 inches to 23 inches and only three fish per angler. Game warden Calvin Atkinson says at first some people were unhappy about the change. He says there are several different kinds of fish in the area and that it's important to protect the numbers for all of them. Spotted sea trout, your red drum, uh, flounder species and the black drum are one of them are some of the more popular species down here in the lower Laguna Madre that anglers uh, target. Atkinson says the Coastal Fisheries Department is always conducting studies to keep an eye on the fish population. He adds if something comes up in their research, they can change the rules quickly. If they see that something needs to be changed immediately, then that would go to our commission and they could basically vote on an emergency order, uh, an executive order to change the bag and size limit. He says that only happens in rare cases. Most of the time, the department makes changes that go into effect on the 1st of September. Atkinson says most anglers are happy the tighter restrictions have gone away. The enforcement action right now, uh, so far, people have been abide, abiding by the size and bag limits. Uh, from what I can see, they're very happy that it went back to the old regulation because now they can keep five fish instead of three. Atkinson says the game wardens are always out enforcing the rules. He reminds everyone to make sure water safety equipment is working properly before heading out and have a valid fishing license. Working for you, I'm Brian Svensson.